And first at six, we are covering some breaking news you'll see only on First Coast News at this hour. An elementary school teacher accused of child sexual exploitation has been arrested again, this time by federal agents. Former Mayport Elementary School second grade teacher Thomas Hazuri Jr. appeared in federal court today. Good evening. Thank you so much for joining us. I'm Jeannie Blaylock. And I'm Anthony Austin. So this story uh, just coming into our newsroom tonight. Hazuri Jr. has been out on bond following his August 19th arrest by the Jacksonville Sheriff's Office, but he's currently in federal custody. So this is what we know. Hazuri's house was raided last month following a tip from the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children. Now, detectives seized his personal computer, which they say contained hundreds of pictures and videos of sexual performance of a child. Investigators also found pictures of students at Mayport Elementary. Now, this federal complaint, this is what is new right now, it outlines some new details. For instance, while the original warrant described the pictures taken at Mayport Elementary as non-sexual, the federal complaint says at least one photo appears to have been taken, quote, at an angle that the viewer can see up the child's shorts. The federal complaint says after being served with the warrant, Hazuri told detectives, quote, I don't mess with kids like that, and added that the situation was, quote, so embarrassing. Asked to comment about the new arrest, Hazuri's attorney, Hank Cox, says federal law, federal prosecutors, same facts, same 15 minutes notice, a reference to the lack of notice he received in either of Hazuri's arrests. Asked if that were a possible federal arrest was initiated because Hazuri was released on bond, he said, I would like to think no government would ever do that. You can find much more on this developing story on our website, firstcoastnews.com.